Welcome to the senior all-star game. The war on the floor. It's the East against the West. We're at St. Genevieve High School in the San Fernando Valley, Panorama City. My name is Randy Rosewell. I'm set to call the play-by-play -play, along with the coach, Borda Scotto of Silmar. Our broadcast is presented by Styling Construction in Chatsworth. See the difference. The West and White, the East in the dark uniforms. And we are expecting a high scoring affair. Bort, what's in store for us tonight? Well, hopefully this will be a uh, high scoring affair, but Randy, I wanted to ask you, how come it feels like we've done this before? Because we have. We just went through a nice all-star game. Here's Porath inside. And the big fella at 6'9 is going to the foul line. He's out of Chaminade. Play for Todd Wolfson there, 6'9", 215 pounds, average 10 points and five rebounds a game. Did you say 6'9"? Six, 6'9". Nine? Six, nine. Wow, there's not too many 6'9 guys in high school these days. As another foul shot coming, he was just a 51% foul shooter this past season for the Chaminade Eagles, and he hits one of two. And it's one for the West, and the East will come up and attack. Mariscal is stripped by Trotter. Jawan Trotter. And a block beautifully by Mariscal. Well, there's a lot of Spartans in this one. Matt Reyes. Well, there's a couple Spartans out there as well. Some of your players are out there, boy, you know that. Here's Hippler from downtown. Rebound to Lahora. And the bullseye out of the corner. That was nicely done. Three to one for the East. Reyes' jump shot. Doesn't fall. Poor Rath. And it taken away the other way. And Lahora. No good. Deflected. And here comes Poor Rath. Three second violation. Tyler Hooks, your outstanding players out there, number 15, wearing the blue uniforms. And there's some nice passing and the basket inside for Markel Moore out of Chavez High School and 5-1 to one for the East. It is. And here's Moore with a rebound. Two minutes into the game, Markel Moore. Here's your player, Tyler Hooks. You're having a fun time again as Mariscal hits a triple. Francisco Mariscal. Here's Trotter's jump shot. And more rebounds. Ahana Missy, who hit the first three of the game. Here's Hooks. And Porath with a spectacular rebound, but he threw it to Hooks. And Tyler Hooks puts it in and draws the foul. All right, what makes Tyler Hooks so good? And he was spectacular for you in your championship win over Granada Hills. And the free throw for Hooks gives him a three-point play. And it's 11-1 to one for the East. They come out here quickly in our small schools all-star game. The war on the floor. Here's Hippler. Down low to Brooks, who can really play. Brooks puts it up around and off. He tips it up and in, though. Nice play by Brooks. Ryan Brooks. Lahora with a wild turnaround shot. Rebound, Porath to Hippler. Trotter's pass intercepted by Anna Missy. And he couldn't put that one in. He certainly did. 16-40 to play in the first half. 11-3 the East on defense leading. Reyes 
Well, he played in this building too. He's from St. Genevieve. And the poly parent, Mariscal, comes up short. Hippler to Brooks, and Ryan lays it in. Well, it's a nice fast break. Ahana Missy to Moore, and the soft touch for Markel Moore. The average nine points a game at Chavez. 13 to 5, the East. Played four minutes. Porath puts it in at 6 9 over Moore. Well, at 6 9, uh, he's the tallest of any of the players out there. He's going to play at Williams College, Division Three school. That's where Porath is going to play. Yes, sir. Here's Hooks with a nice feed to Mariscal on the baseline. Over poor Rap. Francisco Mariscal. 15 to 7. The East shooting well. 15 20 to play in the half. Reyes from downtown. The hometown lad. He really does. He's a valiant from St. Genevieve. Foul on Hippler. Hippler brought his whole family here. I was talking to his mom before the game. There's a whole Hippler contingent. Fifteen to ten, five minutes into the action. Maybe we will. Tyler Hooks, who played point guard for board at Silmar. Tipped and controlled by Jordan Newt. Jordan Newt's talented young player. And Newt will shoot the three. Can't connect there. Newt with the rebound and the outlet pass. This young man is from Taft who just missed the dunk. Damian Wilson. Had a great year for the Toreadors, so that was a thoroughly forgettable effort. Lahore out of the corner. He's got the three ball. The very convenient shooters. Rims, they love it. Brooks from out in front. Three for Ryan Brooks. He's going to play at Westmont College at... Uh, in Santa Barbara. That man from Chav as Markel Moore knocks down a J. 20 to 13, the East. Played six minutes in this first half. Damian Wilson. And Wilson. That one hit the guide wire, so it's out of bounds to the Eastern All Stars. Yes, sir. I'm here to help you define everything that's in the arena. You have questions? Yes. I've seen you coach. I'm here to help you. Now you've won three city championships. You're legendary at Silva. And here's one of your players. Hooks. Yes, you got players all over the floor. Yeah, Galindo's on the other side, isn't he? Galindo trying to defend his own teammate, and he deflected it away. Brooks accelerates and puts it in. Adrian Galindo forced a turnover and a nice drive by Ryan Brooks. 20 to 15, the East by five. Cesar Reyes is checked in. And his air ball is taken by Newt. And this time the slam dunk is accurate by Damian Wilson. Brings the West to within three. 20 to 17, and the scoring is start to uh, mount up now. The teams are starting to put the ball down. Lahora to Reyes. Lahora again, and he knocks down another three ball. Jake Lahora, out of Heritage Christian, played for the Warriors. They're in Northridge. You got it, Reyes. This pass stolen by the alert Damian Wilson, and he's fouled by Cesar Reyes. 
12 16 to play in the half. The East, 23 to 17 over the West. Damian Wilson again, not wearing a number. He's got that white t shirt on. He can handle it, he can explode to the basket. Well deflected away, taken by the Eastern Stars. Reyes not tentative. Oh, he can shoot the ball. Caesar Reyes. 24 game at Poly this year for the Parrots. Newt with a good look inside. They did know that. They did. Mariscal with the three. After Escaita made the basket, here's Jordan Newt. Quick trigger. Taken by Reyes. Caesar's going all the way. They suffered inside by Tyler Brooks. Tyler Hooks. Brooks and Hooks. You got we people come. Some, you, got, got bomb here. you got people. You got people coming up to talk to you, right? Even right during the show, they they know who you are. Hooks at the line. Good foul shooter. Tyler Hooks playing for the Eastern Stars. Six foot, 160 pounder hits one of two. Hooks averaged 16 points a game for Borda Scotto this last year. 29-19, the East by 10. Wilson inside. Going up strong was a skater, and he drew the foul. Skate is going to Cal Lutheran to play his basketball. Jose Escada, another poly parrot. It's interesting, he's playing against two of his teammates. Try to even up the squads at all-star time. He's got his teammate Cesar Reyes is uh, like uh, talking some trash to him right now. Certainly is the East with the ball. Hooks. A little out of his range. And here is Brooks. Damian Wilson with the drive. Pretty play by Damian Wilson. 29-22. Mariscal from way downtown. Here comes Jordan Newt. Fouled by Tyler Hooks. You don't agree with that. Anytime a Spartan gets a foul, you're not happy with that, are you? West won our first All-Star game here earlier tonight, 130 to 122. Would have a lot of points scored in this one as well. Easy basket down low for Escada. I don't think so. Hooks, and he threw it away to Brooks. And Brooks. Double dribbles. And uh, the starters are coming back in in force for Dave Goosen's Western Stars. Alan Waskanian is coaching the East. He's out of Pollock. He's got all his uh, parrots out there. And here's one of them in Cesar Reyes. Step back jumper. And he walked. Damian Wilson in the lane. Reyes with a nice save to Moore. And Markel Moore from deep. They're banging inside and a great rejection by Porath. And it's put back in by Mariscal. 31-22. 
124 the East. Here's Matt Reyes, the hometown boy, and four round. Big fella trying to knock down one from deep. Sean Thompson of Chavez wears number three in the dark uniforms. It's over the end line. Mariscal could not save it. Give the ball to the Western Stars. We've played 11 minutes. West has it, but they're down seven here. Porath off the glass. The beautiful kiss. I'm impressed with Jake Porath. I like Porath. The big fellow can play. He runs the floor nicely. Thompson's shot won't get there. There's more hustling. This time Thompson shot rattles in and out and Porath rebounds. Jawan Trotter into high gear. Hippler all the way. Ryan Hippler for two. A lot of Division two and three schools looking at Hippler. That's beautifully done by Hanamisi. Jarek Ahanamisi. Trotter the other one. Boy, it's fast and furious. East up 34-28. Reyes got away with a push off. Couldn't convert. Trotter hits. Jawan Trotter. Out of Sierra Canyon. Played on a state championship team for Sierra Canyon. Mariscal, no good. Rebound, Wilson. Here comes Damian Wilson. And he's able to draw the foul. He was hit on the arm by Markel Moore. Damian Wilson averaged 17 a game at Taft. He's undecided, but he's gifted athletically. And I can see him at 6'4", playing at a pretty high-level school, this Damian Wilson. And these guys want to win bad. And an opportunity to talk a lot to these young guys, and they are really into it. Tonight's game brought to you by Styling Construction. See the difference. 818-407-1327. Ask for Curly or Mike. All your housing needs. They have great billing terms as well. Styling construction. They do it all. 34-32. The game's tightened up here. The West has clawed to within two. Mariscal can hit it. Hippler controls it to Trotter. Trotter to Reyes. Moore, yes, the three ball, put up and in by Markel Moore. Wilson with the spin, and one for Damian Wilson. Damian Wilson is a physically gifted player. Try to convert the three-point play. 6.49 left first half, East by 37-34. 37-35, I said East by 37-34, then you add a point, it's a two-point game. I just want to make sure we clarify for you. Markel Moore from downtown. Poor Rath puts it in. Even at 37, the West has fought back. And the West can take the lead. Wilson. Caesar Reyes. They have a timeout on the floor. No basket. Wilson's going to be asked to leave the floor. I guess he's a little heated, and the officials want him to cool down. 
I think both players were really asked to move the floor, which is a good move by the push instead of calling technical fouls. Just have the guys sit down and clean up. Again. Well, you like technical fouls. You pick them up in droves. Well, I think sometimes they're technical fouls. Of course, we're chatting with head coach Borda Scotto from Silmar, 49 years young, 21 of those years spent at Silmar. He's won three city titles, won back to back city crowns. Beat Granada Hills in the championship game this year in the city section. And this is uh, one of the reasons Tyler Hooks, the Spartan, draws the foul. Why do you need to? I might, because you're giving out my resume over here. Have they seen you coach? They would certainly be interested with all those championship banners hanging in the Silmar gym. Ohana Missy going to work. Here comes the West. Trotter, yes. Jawan Trotter. And the West leads 39-37. Jawan Trotter's got a silk smooth jumper. He's a Reyes short. Markel Moore flags it down. Lahora and Porath at 6-9. Look at the big fella handling. Hippler with a great look to Porath. And one. Ryan Hippler made the play with a delightful skip pass. And Porath looking for the three-point play. 41-37, the West suddenly leading. Just above five minutes to play in the half. Reyes all the way. Caesar's good in the open court. East to within two. Hippler's pass is deflected away. Ahana Misi to Reyes. And Caesar Reyes with four in a row ties it at 41. And Reyes with the steal. To Hooks. And the East leads by two. Hippler again with that skip pass. Trotter. Tip by Brooks. We're going to have an East foul. And I appreciate the hard work of Ryan Brooks. Average 16 and a half points and eight rebounds a game at Trinity Classical Academy for the Knights. Why he's going to play college ball at Westmont with those flashy numbers. Another thing about Brooks, he averaged over five assists a game. Timeout on the floor with 4.29 left in the half in the East with a 43-42 lead. And tonight's telecast, as always, brought to you by our good friends at Styling Construction. See the difference. Their telephone number is 407 in the 818 area code, 407 1327. No one has their experience or billing term. Styling construction. Ask for Mike or Curly. 43 42. The game is turned on. It's gone back and forth. Very tight affair. Got a great east west game earlier tonight. So many stars in the Valley. They have two East-West games. And it was 130-122 to 122 for the West earlier tonight. And in the girls games, the small schools, the East won 73-63. Large girls, girls. Large girls, the girls on the West side won 76-71. 43 tie here. And a steal by Brooks. To Newt Trotter. Cesar Reyes in the open court. 
Beautiful fast break. East by two. Jordan Newt, who has modeled. He's a singer and he's a shooter. Jordan Newt. What a shot that was. Reyes will drive the baseline. Normally, Caesar would put that away. Trotter to Galindo. No basket, three second violation. Scoreboard says East 45, West 43. Three and a half to play before intermission. Lahora. The West on the attack. Damian Wilson. Galindo, he likes that spot. He hit five of those against Washington Prep in the semifinals. Adrian Galindo. Reyes the other way. 46-45, the West leads after the Galindo jump shot. Newt inside with a great delivery to Galindo. What a pass by Jordan Newt. Reyes didn't shoot it this time. It was his teammate putting it up, and it was an air ball for Francisco Mariscal. I said he didn't shoot it. 48-45. Jordan Newt, a very clever player. Nearly had another three. Ahanamissi the other way. Lahora in the corner. Galindo gets free. Hooks with the block. Goaltending. Couple Spartans colliding with one another. West by two, 50 to 48 with two minutes to play. Cesar Reyes takes it all the way in. We're even at 50. Reyes unstoppable down the stretch here in the first half. And one for Damian Wilson. How do you stop him? He's so physical getting to the basket. Handles the ball with such precision. Hooks from downtown. Had a good look. And Brooks rebounds. Galindo, the three ball. He's got that standing three, Adrian Galindo, but he's a great shooter. Escada. Jose Escada with the throwdown. have a timeout. The scoreboard is fouled up. I don't think it's 53-50. Well, again, the scoreboard's incorrect. Yep, and they put two more up. It's 55-50 to for the West. I wanted to correct that. Now they've made it 58-50. So the West leading by eight. Now by 10 as Wilson's able to score. 60 to 50. Cesar Reyes misses. Wilson again draws the foul. Mariscal got him on the arm. Damian Wilson. And the West, again, 
Goosen doing a terrific job. Dave Goosen, the West coach out of Valley Academy. And we talked about it with our earlier All-Star game because these coaches have worked with both teams. Goosen just gets his players in the right place. How about this performance by Damian Wilson? And you said these teams wouldn't get to 100? This could be a first. Wilson throws it to Lahora of the East. Final 15 seconds of the half. Ahana Misi. And he was fouled. Newt got him on the arm. So a chance for a four point play. For Jerick Ahana Misi from Village Christian. Average 10 a game. Jerick's been good in the practice. Talking to Waskani and their coach, he's very impressed with him. 62-53, here comes Newt. Final five seconds. Galindo out of the corner. What a shooter Adrian Galindo in. Corner pocket for Adrian Galindo. And the West leads at half 65-53. A blistering shooting display by the Western All-Stars.